Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about divisibility tests. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help, you use Minute Math. We want to determine whether 1,290 is divisible by 2, 3, 5, and 10. Let's start with 2. Well, is it divisible by 2? Well, what's the last digit? Let's look at it. It's a zero. If it ends in zero, two, four, six, or eight, it is divisible by two. So that is a yes. And we can check that. One, two, nine, oh, divided by two comes out evenly to be a 645. Now, what about three? Is one, two, nine, zero divisible by three? Well, the trick with a 3 is to add up the digits. So we take, well, 1, uh, let me erase that here. 1 plus 2 plus 9 plus 0, and what does that equal? 1, 2, 9 plus 0, 1 plus 2 is a 3, plus 9 is a 12. Is Does 3 go into 12? Yes, it does. So yes. 1,290 is divisible by 3, and that comes out to be, on my cheat sheet here, a 430. What about 5? 1, 2, 3, or 2, 3, 5. What about 5? Well, if the last digit ends in a 0 or a 5, it's divisible by 5. In this case, it's a 0, so yes, it is. And 1,290 divided by 5 is a good old 258 if we check it out. Lastly, 10. Is 1,290 divided by, divisible by 10? Does it end in a zero and it's larger than 10? If it does, then yes, it is divisible by 10. So yes here. And 1,290 divided by 10 is just 129. So if it's equal to 10, or larger than 10 ends in a zero, well then it's divisible by 10. So hopefully you learned something here on divisibility tests. If you did, make sure you like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. This helps us make more of these free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching.